I've said this numerous times on this channel that once PDP allow Wiki to continue all of his back and forth he's been doing and public disgrace of his fellow PDP members, this is going to further embolden him to do more. And I think this is what we are seeing play out here. Wiki, you would think that the PDP would have taken a strong stance and disciplined this man. But at this point, <laughs> it seems as if most of them are afraid of Wiki at this point. Wiki is the Lord. <laughs> Wiki is the Lord. I think we can all agree at this point. Wiki is the Lord. Is their father in PDP. Because I don't think there is any other individual that is most feared in PDP more than Wiki at this point. Wiki, during the time that uh, they were busy suspending each other, we were busy discussing the future of Damago and all over. He was quiet, you know, patiently, probably waiting for what PDP was going to decide on. But now that he's realized that people, these people do not even have the guts to do anything to me, he has gone on, he has embarked on another round of uh, is it backlash to the PDP governors Atiku and the likes. Before we delve right into the details of today's news, if this is your first time here, you haven't subscribed to this channel, what are you doing? You've been on YouTube and you've not plugged into this channel. Please go ahead and click on it before you miss any further information. Also, most importantly, help us click the like button. This will encourage us to put out more content. Don't forget to also leave your opinions in the comment section below as well. Minister of Federal Capital Territory, FCT, Yosom Wiki, yesterday said it would continue to be a problem to former Vice President Atiku Abubakar, Mr. Peter Obi, and governors elected on the platform of People's Democratic Party, PDP. He also berated River State Governor Seminala Yifubara for allegedly casting aspersions on some elders, describing him as an ingrate. Wiki who spoke at a luncheon he organized in honor of a 10th Legislative Assembly of River State in Port Harcourt, said he has no regrets supporting President Bola Tinubu instead of his party's presidential candidate, Vice President Atiku Abubakar, in the 2023 elections. His words, in fact, most of you do not understand the fight that is going on. Do you think it is these people here? No. Let me tell you what is going on. I have no regret at all, and we have no regret at all for supporting President Ashiwa Jubala Tinubu. I have no, no regret about it. All these things you are seen by Atiko's group, Peter Obi's group, and some PDP governors that believe that I am a problem to them and I will continue to be a problem to them. In fact, the Atiko's group believes that my team and I stopped them from becoming president and we stopped injustice. What we wanted was equity, fairness, and justice. While speaking about Fubara, we can say the governor insulted the former president of the Nigerian Bar Association, NBA, OCG, or Kochan. You or what are your thoughts? Let's have them in the comment section below. What do you think about Wiki saying that he doesn't regret supporting President Bola Metinubu? You guys, what do you think about that statement? Especially considering the kind of hardship that a lot of people are in right now in Tinobu's administration. I think that it, do, it cannot even get worse than this. It has never gotten worse than this. Because at this point, hmm, <laughs> let me not even say what I wanted to say. At this point, it's quite terrifying because if we're experiencing this most, much hardship, just with a, a year of uh, President Bola Tinubu's administration, what is going to happen in the next three years or what is going to happen in the next four years? And let's not even... I don't even want to think about second tenure at this point. What is going to happen, guys? And here we have a politician who traded... Who traded... What... <laughs> Who, who traded with the devil, who traded with Tinobu, he dealt with Tinobu like he had a deal with Tinobu that I'll, I'll give you reverse dates as long as you give me an appointment 
uh, during your regime, no problem. We are going to have an handshake on that. And that was exactly what happened. PDP has not been in Azurok for quite some time. And, you know, we can envisage in that. <laughs> the way I'm looking at it, the APC is still going to win because they're the one at the federal level. So let me just trade. So let me just shift a little bit to the APC. I'm not going to leave the PDP party. Let me just shift a little. Let me just be in the middle. Right now, we, can, we cannot even say is a full-fledged member of a PDP, nor can we say is a full-fledged member of APC. It's just there in the middle, you know, getting benefits from APC and then <laughs> trying to even destroy his party in the process. And now he's saying to Nigerians that, I do not regret voting for the person that is suffering you, the person that is causing you all this hardship and trouble. I do not regret supporting him, giving him my support and, you know, helping him to become president, despite the fact that petrol price is now above 1,000 naira. It's, it's quite sad. But you all, before we go, let's take a look at a few reactions we got online. John Ugbojiono says, Wiki, no is Unwaki. That's the original name. Wiki, as you called yourself in the Bible, do you hear about Nebuchadnezzar? You saw how he ended. God is watching you. Wiki or Unwaki. Hmm. Johnson says, Atiku is the worst thing Nigeria has ever produced. Even the manufacturer, OBJ, regrets of this great mistake. Raymond Okon, Okonla says, Wiki, the rock, Ashiwaju of Rivers 001 of Abuja, we stand with Wiki, one with God is one with majority. Wiki respects, but mind you, I know your pain with Wiki because Wiki destroy your brother. Biafusogu, United States President, Peter Obi is in last general election. Obi is boy baby politician. Obi can't win, can't win election in Nigeria. Don't cry again, your papa. One million can't stop Wiki, Wiki the Rock. Hmm. This is an obvious supporter of Wiki. Let's take a last comment from Chuchu Okata. Person in authority who uses their power to demean or hum humiliate others. Yes, some wiki is someone who struggles with alcoholism, often consuming excessive amounts, leading to erratic behavior and neglect of responsibilities. Unfortunately, they also exhibit abusive tendencies, frequently insulting and belittling others including using derogatory. Their leadership style is marked by emotional manipulation, intimidation, and disregard for others' feelings. You or what are your thoughts? Let's have them in the comment section. Thank you very much for always listening and watching, guys. I will see you all in my next video. Bye for now.